the Niners have a lot of free agents, some starters, one on defense, nose tackle DJ Jones, hell of a player, free agent, should the Niners re-sign up? No. Why? Because they've been able to they've been able to replicate or 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 do without guys and and insert guys and have a lot of success um on all around the defensive line on those secondary guys. Like they can't replicate Nick Bosa, but the interior guys and and um their secondary and and third pass rushers. Coach Eric has coached all those guys up and been able to find guys. That is true. That is true. Unless unless TJ Jones is is going to come back on a reasonable deal, um, I don't think you can resign him. You you've got Ken Lock. Stay with that though, because he did come back on a reasonable deal last year. Last year he signed a one year contract, three point four million dollars. If he would be willing to take a one year four million dollar contract, I'd give him that. Yeah, it's possible. But the other thing is. My question is, is what's going on with Tart and what's going on with Lake and Tomlinson? Because we're going to talk about Tomlinson next. I think I'm, we're not going to talk about Tart today. I don't think Tart's worth much. I think if they want Tart, they can have Tart. If they don't want Tart, he'll leave. You think they'll have competition for Tart? I don't really want to talk about Tart. I think they've he heard a lot. He, I don't know. I think they can have Tart if they want him. DJ Jones is a good player. Sorry, Tart. DJ Jones is a player there might be a market for. There wasn't last year. There might be this year. I wouldn't compete. I wouldn't give him a what was it, the Kerry Hyder deal? We got three years, 30 million. Yeah, he's, he's a good he's a good player, but but the problem yeah. is is it easier to find a defensive tackle or is it easier to find a safety? Or, hard, or difficult. Like it's a lot more difficult to find a safety that I can trust. Yeah, it's easier I, to find. I am not one of those guys that's cool with inserting Hofanga and ready to ready to rock. I think there's a there's a big difference between Tart and Hufanga. So Depending on what the price is and what what's going on with those other guys, um, I am one that if I had to pay DJ Jones, I would let him walk because I've got Coaster. Coaster has proved he's been able to coach guys up and find guys and and make it work. Yeah. Okay, I'm with you. Like, don't break the bank for this guy. If the Seahawks want to give him three years, thirty million, like they did Kerry Hyder last year, don't compete. But if there's surprisingly no market for DJ Jones, like there wasn't last year, like there wasn't for K1 and Tart, you should yeah, make, him make him an offer. Here's a one year, here's another one year deal. Here's four, four million. Here's a raise. Yeah. 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 And because he's a good starter on this team, better than the quarterback. Anyway, yeah, not, not, not too much. What if Jed wants D'Amico to stay one more year in case Kyle fails again? He would be Kyle's head coach replacement. You think D'Amico wrote him a check, gave him a, gave him a, I don't think so. You can. They're not going to fire Kyle for losing the NFC Championship. Game. Has a head coach ever been fired and replaced by their coordinator? Like, does that ever happen? They usually clear house, right? That would be a mutiny almost. Yeah. Um, I can't think of it. If you give viewers, if you know, let us know. You talk often about black coach and black quarterbacks have a hard time getting opportunities. So is it racism in the NFL or something else? Kyle doesn't seem to be like that. What do you think? Look at the owners. Look at the owners. What do they have in common? What do they look like billionaires who are white. I don't know how woke and diverse and I don't know people like that are. How many white billionaires do you know? But it seems like they all are kind of similar and they're a little behind the times and they're what they find acceptable. I don't know. It seems like a lot of these white billionaire owners are you know uh, expecting to have white people in places of leadership on their team. Seems like it. I can't. I'm not. I can't prove it. But that seems to be the pattern. Some teams more than others. Like there are some organizations that have never had a black coach or a black quarterback ever. Are the Giants one? I don't know. The Giants, I don't think they've ever had a black no, coach. The, the Giants, they started um, Gino Smith. Gino. There you go. They got Gino. A couple of games. You see what I'm saying, Greg? Good, good question. Sugar Shane says the third round picks we get, McDaniel uh, would help replenish the roster as we're losing a lot of talent this year. Oh, yeah, because he's half black. You get a, a third round pick for him. He is half black. I didn't know that. He is. Yes. Third round pick. How about that? Mm. Forgot about that. Fake crowd noise needs to be banned. Rams 100% were pumping. Also, the disrespect of them playing Mac Dre E40 and too short at the end of the game. I wasn't there. I had COVID. I was at home. Yeah. I wasn't there. I wasn't there either. But um, 
I know everyone before the game was like, oh, it's like 80% Niners fans in here. And then, <laughs> then they lost. I thought was, I, I wanted to make fun of it because everyone does that. And I never tweet a lot of red in the crowd. But every road game, you get that tweet, and it's like, you know what? It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. And I, I But Niners fans love that. And you always get like two or 3,000 likes when you put that tweet out. So people do it. And uh, I wanted to really troll the Niners after and be like, so how would that 65%? audience share do you and this one huh but i didn't want to really want to rub it in but i'm doing it now third quarter 1228 watch i when you do the film review with jack miami is over uh correcting flores was a jackass to everyone hope it works out for mike uh jimmy garoppolo spots pittsburgh carolina new york g football team um any team that's really dumb i'm sorry pittsburgh no they're too smart carolina maybe giants maybe football team i don't know maybe I Carolina and football team. I, I don't know. I think Giants are still in, are in rebuild mode, mode. I don't think Jimmy G is going there. Um, Third quarter, twelve twenty eight. I, I will. Maybe, maybe. Didn't even say what to watch for. What do you think it is? Wide open, deep. Um, I don't know. I don't know.